making a video? Yeah. Look how tight that is. Morning. Well, we've got the uh, our battery box mounted in our uh, rear of our vehicle. Um, it is securely held down. Now we're going to be cutting some vent holes, and uh, I've also got to cut a hole for the uh, to bring in the uh, high voltage and the uh, control wiring for the uh, for our pack tracker. The way I did this, um, I took and split the side of the um, the very bottom. You can see, I uh, hit it with the uh, grinder, and I bent it all just a tad with a tap of the hammer, and the box slid right into place. It is uh, sitting here completely square and uh, we're going to put we've already got it mostly bolted down that's our second row we're going to have one more row of uh, bolts right now we have 16 in it spaced out evenly and, uh, she should be completely secured once I have uh, we're also going to be putting a uh, a sheet of plywood down to cover up the uh, height of the uh, head of the bolts. They go all the way through the body and are secured from the back sides. So these are well, well secured. She's not going to move. Alright, this is our front battery box, just like the rear, it's uh, made out of quarter inch, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, one eighth steel plate. Uh, it's going to support five batteries, you're going to have three batteries this way and two the other way, so that's going to go in the front. We have a, uh, still waiting on the rack for it.